Hello, it is Sunday Fun Day, pretty much the end of Sunday Fun Day, August 26, 2018, Steve Cypress here, the sun has set, beautiful summer evening here, and uh, you know, once a, once a week it's a day of rest and it's a good day to turn the brain off and just relax and recharge and get ready to tear into the week tomorrow. George is here, good seeing you. So, Tim Johnson, my man, is here. So we watched two uh, totally brain-dead movies where you can remove your brain and just watch them and have fun. The first one was a remake of The Towering Inferno starring The Rock. What is up, Tim? And uh, that, of course, was as mindless as it sounds, but fun. A lot of special effects. And uh, the ending is a shocker. No one could ever guess the ending. And, uh, and then we just watched the Ocean's 8. That's like the all-female version of these. Uh, you know, it was kind of shot the same way. I wonder if it was the same director or whatever as these. Probably not. They probably got a, a woman to direct it because they were making a statement that it's the Me Too woman's time and all that. But, you know, that was also brain dead and fun too. And now I think since it's only about, what time is it here? Oh, a little after 8 o'clock. I think we're going to watch one more movie. So if anyone out there has a suggestion, anyone got a suggestion, kind of a, you know, just a way to pass a couple hours here, relax, hit the sack, wake up, hit the ground running with a big week, a couple of projects that I'm bringing to a close this week, so that's exciting, and might start another one, and Tim says, can't wait to see you in Chicago, that's right, my annual, three times a year, my clients gather together in person. And we'll be meeting in Chicago in about two weeks. It'll be exciting to see you, Tim, there and the rest of my clients. And we're going to have a fantastic couple of days of a masterminding session back in good old Chicago, where I lived for, uh, I don't know, about 15 years or so and hosted hundreds of mastermind and other events for entrepreneurs. So it'll be fun to back, be back home. But most fun of it is going to be being with you, Tim, and some other really super duper sharp entrepreneurs for a couple of days. Big deals are always made there when my clients get together. And uh, so there'll be some new friendships built, some old ones built stronger. And uh, I predict lots of money will be made, lots of fun will be had, lots of learning and growth will occur. Tim says, I'm in the loop right now with my grandbaby. How cool is that? Really, right in the middle of downtown Chicago. That's, uh, for pe people who don't know, that's called the Loop, where the elevated train runs around, but kind of in a rectangle, not a circle, around. And uh, that's known as the L, and the intersection of that train running around a rectangle is known as the Loop. The absolute inner downtown of Chicago, where... Interesting you're there at the end of a day on a Sunday because the place is, there's nothing going on. Nothing, even like 4 or 5 o'clock in the afternoon during the week, that whole place shuts down. It's kind of business only, but very cool. Yes, Tim mentions the, the great uh, book by Akib Taleb. Uh, not Akib, that's a, a football player, I believe. Uh, the Black Swan. Look it up if you're not familiar with it and make sure you're prepared for it even though you don't know what it is or when it'll happen. Tim, I know you do that as a practice. You help others do it and that's a key to your success which you have massive success and I just love seeing it. And yes, anything can happen at uh, my, when my clients get together. I have some of the sharpest entrepreneurs in the world that I work with. And when I get them together, all kinds of great things happen. So I don't see any recommendations for a movie. Tim, you got one? Anybody else? Maybe if you're watching on a replay, just put it in there. Because if I don't watch it tonight, maybe I'll watch it some other time. Or sometimes you can see these things like on the Netflix, like you watch a whole season of a TV show. We didn't feel like doing that because see, then take some thought involved to like think about the next episode, the last episode, what's going on. I generally like Sundays to be a completely brain dead, relaxing day. So I can just clear everything out, recharge, hit the ground running tomorrow, which I will do. And so to George and Tim and anybody else here or on the replay, I will call it a night with you. I'm gonna go back and be with my beautiful wife, Michelle. We'll turn on another silly flick. We'll watch that. 
and I will catch you tomorrow when I dip into my mailbox and right there live on camera with you I will share what goes through my mind as I sort through my mail. Some I open, some I don't, some I read, some I respond to, and I will share why I do, why I don't, what could be done better to make that stuff work. And it'll help you even whether you use direct mail or not or any other type of marketing or advertising. And Jeff is here. Good seeing you, Jeff. And uh, who else? Uh, well, very nice. Tim says that she is beautiful, my beautiful wife, Michelle, and Brian's here. All right, we'll call it a night. Hope you're having a fantastic night wherever you are. I'll catch you tomorrow on Direct Mail Monday. Thanks to everyone being here live. Thanks to everyone here on the replay, and we'll catch you tomorrow. Bye-bye.